What's up, YouTube? Fatty McDubes. Back at it. Finally. My uh, internet was down for a few weeks. Um, somebody hit the AT&T box that services my area, my street, couple streets. I don't know how all that goes, but uh, they were taking their good old time getting it back up. And I mean, we're, we're talking weeks that I was like, you know, what's going on? And, uh, you know, oh, you're going to have to wait a little bit while longer, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, whatever, I'm tired of hearing the same old song and dance, canceled my uh, service and trying to get somebody else now, but there's only so many people who service my area, so I've got to make a decision soon. Um, as you guys can see, we're uh, now vegging under dormgrow.com's G8 LED, the 450 watts full spectrum. It has... Uh, High quality infrared diodes, ultraviolet diodes, and uh, 6,000 Kelvin white diodes. They're uh, 3 watts a piece. Um, it draws 280 watts of power. Uh, it's 450 watt LED though, and uh, it's the equivalent of uh, 800 HID. It has a 12 foot coverage area. Um, 50,000 our lifetime, two year warranty, um, yeah, you can save 500 watts every hour with it, I'm sorry I'm reading off of the uh, notebook because I, I wanted to get all the specs in here for you guys, uh, it's 17.8 uh, pounds, 17 and a half inches by 11 inches by 3 inches, and uh, penetration of up to 60 inches past the plant canopy so I mean it's a pretty powerful LED man it when when I first wake up and I come in here and look I can't even really open my eyes it hurts really bad um, and you can uh, check them out at dormgrow.com they have uh, 600 watt LED panels 900 watt they have the uh, 90 watt UFO LED for uh, Bloom Enhancer, which if I was going to flower with this light, I could in here. I would just want to get a, uh, you know, the 90 watt red LED UFO for, uh, you know, Bloom Enhancing and uh, a, a better yield. Um, you keep it about two feet to th uh, 24 to 30 inches from the top of your canopy. And, uh, you know, no exhaust or anything like that. I don't have uh, any fan, well, you know, fan for in here blowing air around, but, uh, and, and the temperature's staying good in there, so that's what's up. Really impressed with, uh, you know, LEDs. You know, when I was looking at LEDs when I first started, you know, they were the small little panels with like one watt diodes and just not really doing it, you know, and uh, they've come a long way, so I'm uh, really excited to see what's going to happen with them. Um, what we got going on here are cream of the crop seeds, the black gold, black gold automatic on the right here in the four gray cups, and then the narcotic Kush automatics in the five red cups. The black gold is a maple leaf times Hindu Kush times Brazilian, I want to say, and uh, the narcotic Kush is a uh, Afghan Kush variety of auto flower so doing those we'll be transplanting those shortly into about uh, one gallon containers or no excuse me I'm tripping those are uh, like two gallon containers and those will be their final home and uh, we'll leave them in here for a week or two and then uh, put them into the new room which will be a uh, separate video but you guys will see what's going on uh... thanks for watching guys i'm glad uh... glad to be back glad to be doing my thing again obviously you can see the tents back up uh... the clips aren't well they were broke i had to order some new ones off of uh... amazon and the new ones that came were so much thicker and sturdier dude like i was really impressed with them so pretty happy about that um, things are going a lot better trying to get stuff rolling and uh, looking forward to all the new content and things going on out there uh, thanks for watching again go check out the dormgrow.com if you want good LEDs 
at a really good price. Check them out. Um, they they are uh, cheaper than most. I wouldn't say that they are the cheapest, but uh, you you definitely get a good quality light for a lot less than you know fifteen hundred dollars. You know a lot like what a lot of other companies are charging. So, all right, Fatty McDubes. Did you see?